The really great thing about the History and Languages course in Cambridge is that we combine the best of history and the best of, of language. I've always believed that you can't really understand history without culture. You can't understand culture without history. Language is the real key to both of those things. And that's what we offer in the course here. In terms of resources, Cambridge has absolutely fantastic libraries which can be accessed online as well as in person. It's got world-class experts that deliver a lot of the teaching um, and it has a lively set of undergraduates who provide perhaps some of the best peer group teaching that you'll get. Students acquire a wide variety of skills on this particular course. For one thing they learn skills of critical analysis and reasoning which are very highly sought after by employers in our experience. They also learn languages to a very high standard indeed, meaning that they're able to go away and work in foreign languages after they've taken the degree. And on this particular course, you also have the option to spend a year abroad, which gives you access to life in foreign universities or in the country of your choice. There are a number of places available and the year abroad really is um, very special aspect of the course and a, and a great um, part, much liked, much popular amongst the students. Studying at Cambridge is such a unique experience. I find that the supervision style of teaching is just so incredible. I can talk about my work with an expert on the topic, so I get a lot of input and a lot of attention, which is why it is possible to achieve so much in such a short space of time. I think if you're thinking of applying, always bear in mind that the admissions uh, tutors aren't really looking for perfection. Reading around your subject, learning what interests you, that's probably what will set you up best for applying to Cambridge. I chose this course at Cambridge basically because I couldn't decide between history or Russian. Um, I love them both and also I saw so many links between the two of them so what particularly interests me is how um, history is portrayed in literature and so that's something that I want to study with this course. It is just sort of an amazing experience to be studying at Cambridge with not just all the people that have gone before but also knowing all of the academic activity that's going on here and having all the resources that the university's acquired over time is so helpful to study and being part of the system that sort of prioritises your personal learning is really beneficial to an undergraduate and that's what makes it a really special experience. Being part of Cambridge University is really exciting. It's quite surreal to say, um, but it's so amazing to be here and surrounded by so many people who are so enthusiastic about what they study. I love it.